basketball team. They're down in Greensboro, North Carolina. That's where we find Adam Rosso live tonight. He's talking a little bit more about their star guard, Tania Davis. Things get rolling down here in Greensboro tomorrow morning. The second seeded Hawkeyes in their first Sweet 16 since 2014. Now, one of the unsung heroes for this Iowa team is senior point guard Tania Davis. Davis, a tough upbringing in Flint, Michigan. Her teammates calling her a feisty dog out there on the court, and it's pretty easy to see why when you know all the difficulties that she's faced. To be able to play basketball my entire life and to make it to the Sweet 16, I mean, not many people where I'm from can say that. Whether it's growing up in a challenging place like Flint, Michigan. I walked in and she looked at me um, with tear-filled tear eyes and said, you know, I did it again. Or tearing her ACL in both knees in the span of just 10 months, Tania Davis is the epitome of perseverance. Obviously, this is something that I've been dreaming of and wanting since I've gotten to Iowa, but I'm just living in this moment and enjoying this opportunity because, you know, for me especially, it only com comes around once. It almost didn't come around at all. Davis says she strongly considered calling it a career after her second knee injury in December of 2017. Just sitting through practices and games, um, that definitely got to me a lot, but um, huge credit to my family and my, my close friends who kept me level-headed and, you know, helped me see that there is definitely a light at the end of the tunnel. Tonight, Davis loves basketball more than anyone I know. She's always watching it. She's got an amazing basketball IQ, so um, to have that happen to her a second time, it was just heartbreaking for all of us. Alexis Civilian has been best friends with Davis since high school together in Flint. She says Davis's mindset after getting through the adversity has helped the Hawks blossom this season. Just a positive attitude, outlook that she's had and mentality that she's had throughout the entire process. She keeps everyone level-headed, everyone calm, and um, I don't know, I feel like we have strived and um, grown as a team because of her. That mentality should serve Davis and the entire Hawks team pretty well tomorrow as they try to get to their first Elite Eight since 1993. I have to say they're a pretty fun-loving and relaxed group out, group out here on the court at practice this morning. We'll see if that translates over to the game. Everyone set your alarms back there in Iowa. It's a 10.30 Central Time tip, so if you're out late tonight, be sure to get up and cheer the Hawks on as they try to advance one round further. Reporting live from Greensboro, North Carolina, Adam Rosso, Local 5 Sports, We Are Iowa.